A very warm welcome to you. We are doing the recording of 4th of June's God's Blessing. We've been missing out on the past three days of God's Blessings, but don't worry about it. We'll be getting the morning blessings of each day in the morning time and in the evening time. The previous days, you can listen to it on the same channel. So I'll be posting that in the evening time. That is the previous day's blessings. So let's get back to today's blessing. Supreme Father wants us to be Trikaldarshi and knowledgeable and then decide the past and the present and the future of any action which we take so that that action doesn't go waste. And sometimes we don't give priority to something which is very important and we give priority to something else and then we realize, oh, I wasted so much of time. And that is what we're talking about over here. So God says, may you be a knowledgeable Trikaldarshi soul who carries out every act after carefully considering its past and its future that means you are concerned about what is going to happen if i take this action right now to the past that means if i'm going to do this act with the soul today that soul is going to come back in the cycle and again meet me and take the exchange of that energy which i am giving to that soul today it's a very deep aspect because we souls are exchanging energy on this platform that is earth on a daily basis so that's why god says that is by keeping the three aspects of time in their intellects the trikaldashi children who carry out every act considering its past and future that is by keeping the three aspects of time in their intellects receive success in every action let it not be that because you were very busy, you just began to do the work that came in front of you. That means if something we are doing, we are very busy in some action and we are just going randomly doing the things just because it came in front of us. No, before you perform any action, instill the habit that you think about its three aspects of time perform any action while being stable in the Trikal Darshi stage and no action will become wasteful or ordinary. That means I was supposed to do something else right now that was very important but I ended up doing something randomly because I was so busy I couldn't think and just that work came in front of me because of which certain other things got delayed and because of which other souls got a little panicky or the souls became a little weary or the souls became a little disheartened. So what did I do? What energy did I give them? I gave them the energy of complete negativity. And that energy is gone to them. And that energy is going to come back to me either in this present or future or in the cycle next. So I have to be very careful what kind of energies I'm giving and every action has to be thought about the three aspects of time. Is it important? Is it important right now? Should I do this or should I do something which is more important than this? If I don't do this on time, time, how is it going to affect somebody else? And how much should I put my energies into this present work as compared to that present work? Now, this is something which we need to do on a daily basis. That's what we do, right? In terms of food habits, in terms of something else, when you go and buy something, we are very careful in choosing whether we should buy this for long term should we buy something in a short term thing same thing goes over here for karmas because we are exchanging energies so you can learn more about this beautiful vartan when you come to Pramakumari center and understand what is three kal darshi past present and future and what exactly does it mean as for the world drama cycle with this om shanti